Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you a game where I beat a 1500 while playing 95 accuracy. It was a beautiful game. And I'm starting off with the angling bamboo. It's my, one of my favorite openings is black, and I'm going to start moving away from it. Because this is so. I play for the main line, looking for, for the camera. Looking for something like that. I just give the pawn back for development. I have an active queen. They offer a queen trade, which I accept. As you can see, the eval is dead even. So they have a knight in the center threatening a fork. So I'll defend against that fork. And they push looking to. Fettuccine, their bishop. I look for a knight trade, which I get. And then I castle. Now they have their bishop fettuccine going on. For that, if I ever move this bishop. Now I play check, and the bishops get traded. And their king is out. I push this pawn. Looking to build a center and develop my bishop, which is exactly what happens. Basically, when I was playing this game, my thought process was get this to the end game and hope for a draw. Because a draw, sorry about that, a draw was plus four to me. So that's when I was content with a draw. They kick my bishop out. I have to go back to one of these three squares, or else it's. If I drop back here, it's just gonna get trapped on the very next move. So that's what I do. They slide their rook over, maybe to attack my king. I slide my rook over. You want me to slide it over one more? It's alright. They drop their bishop back, giving me the first slight advantage of point one. I push my pawn, which was the best move. I think I just keep pushing pawns. And they played that I took, which is an inaccuracy, blundering my whole point one advantage. They recapture. They look for more pawn trades. And they make a mistake here, is when I take, I get my rook in. Threatening this, threatening this, threatening this. Oh, no, they blunder. I take the pawn. They move the rook. I take the other pawn. So I'm up plus two and I'm like, oh my god, I'm gonna win. They move the rook. And in fact, I attack the bishop. They cannot take because of the pin. Now uh, the big trades come off the board. The five versus three. I executed this perfectly. So I run pick up that pawn. Now I just run my other pawn up the board. Trade. Their king gets it. Now I look for a trade of pawns. I just lock it. They're never gonna get them. My queen. They take. I push. Check. Check. Sacrifice the queen because I'm just gonna get a new one. And now I get a bit of bad manners here and make another queen. And now I just check me. Beautiful sequence here. I need a knight and four. Beautiful. And that is how I beat a 1500. Played like a 2150, had 100 accuracy in the opening, 95.5 and 93.3. They had 72, 81, and 95. So, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. There will be more videos to come. Have a good rest of your day slash night.